SMT Nation, we back. Nation, you ever wondered what you can do if you want the Verizon Wireless Network, but you don't want to go with Verizon proper? You know, like the, the postpaid Verizon plans, looking for something more affordable, maybe something on more consumer-friendly terms? Well, this article from Daniel Allen, and it's androidpolice.com, link in the description, kind of highlights every single... I guess, prepaid and MPNO option that uses the Verizon network. So you get the benefits of the large, robust, capacitive Verizon network, but you get it through a brand that'll sell it to you uh, without the postpaid connections, all those different, you know, fees and charges and taxes and uh, maybe terms that you'll like better. Anyways, let's cover all of them. Let's look at the brands, see what they offer, what are the good options. And, um, and if anything is missed by the article, let's, let's see if we can get it for the folks that are watching it. Comment down below at any point in the video uh, to offer your uh, additional commentary on it. Anyways, um, link for the article in the description. Ways to support us can be found there. Please do like, share, and uh, if you're new here, subscribe so you never miss an upload from the SMT. All right, so you want the Verizon network, but you don't want to pay Verizon directly. Here's what you could do. Let's look at some of these options. And some of these options I've actually never heard of. Uh, and some of them uh, we're pretty well versed in and, and we're pretty aware of, of the brands and, you know, their existence. All right. So the first one mentioned here is Affinity Cellular. Never heard of them. Looks like they sell a plan by the minutes and the text. And then they also sell uh, shared data and unlimited data. Uh, it says here that they do not have service in Alaska. No international options. But they do discount multiple lines and they do sell a lot of phones. So uh, maybe worth your consideration, Affinity Cellular. I don't know if that's regional. I don't know if it's national. First time I've heard of that one. All right, next one is Boom Mobile. Lots of plan to choose from. They do offer international coverage in dozens of countries. It says only iPhones are available for sale. So that might be something that be might be make or break for some of you in the Android space. But um. They have a cheap plan that's $8 per month that includes a half a gig of data. Uh, all voice plans do include unlimited talk and text starting at $19 per month, and that includes 2 gigs of, of 5G data. They do offer annual plans starting at $60 per year with 500 megs of data, half a gig, 500 voice minutes, 500 texts. Uh, I, I think I've heard of Boom Mobile, but uh, not something I'm, I'm pretty uh, versed in. I've haven't even looked at their plans before. The next option is Charity Mobile. They have an unlimited data plan that's sixty dollars per month for a line. For thirty bucks, you get a gig data shared between all lines on the plan. Good selection of devices, BYOD support. They do have a credit check. A minimum credit score is required. You must use a SIM from them, and it's an expensive international service. So I don't know, but uh, they do donate five percent of the cost of your plan to pro-life charity of your choice so that's pretty cool here's credo mobile i've never heard of this one 35 dollars per month for a gig of data 70 bucks gets you unlimited unlimited talk and text and 5g access included they do sell and lease phones um free calls to canada mexico so some international support does appear to be one of the pricier options and then uh the the data is is quite expensive with 15 dollars per gig on overages uh, but they're also one of those charity focused mvnos uh, supporting progressive organizations voted on by users and touch wireless uh, they do have the lifeline program support and uh, it says here you get unlimited voice and text four and a half gigs of data for free in kentucky you get one gig of data for free anywhere else the free plan comes with four and a half gigs of data 300 voice minutes and Text. Strengths here, deeply discounted plans for those who qualify. Free international, Canada, China, India, Mexico, South Korea, the UK, and Vietnam. I, wow, that's pretty good international support. Uh, so plans only offered through Lifeline, limits to certain qualifications. They don't sell name branded phones, and it's not available in all states. So that's kind of important to understand those limitations. Next, we have Lexvor. I've never heard of this one. $10 per month, one gig of data. $60 per month. Uh, gets you 100 gigs of data. 
Both include uh, 5G, Wi-Fi calling features, and limited talk and text. It says here, make Lexvor crypto by deploying branded hotspots. So this sounds a lot like the Helium Mobile. The cons here is expensive international service rates. Top plan isn't available to phone numbers previously on Verizon or an MVNO that used Verizon net is used Verizon's networks. So that might be make or break if you are going to BYOD. All right, next one, and this is a brand we know, Mobile X. They've got a plan starting at $14.88. Limited talk and text, 5 gigs of unthrottled data. $10 more, you bump up to 30 gigs. Get unlimited talks and text to Mexico and Canada. So they've got a couple options there that are pretty good for pricing. Data forecaster feature on the app allows, to, allows you to kind of figure out what's the best data use calculation. They do sell phones now and support, uh, you know, all those different deals that you might be looking for. Limited amount of plans, but the rates are fair. Uh, the SIM kit is $10. Important things to know. But a dollar per gig is a pretty damn good deal if you only need, you know, a little bit of data. Then you have a brand known as Proven Services. I've never heard of this one. 100 minutes of voice, 100 text messages, 100 megs of data, $10 per month. Limited talk and text starting at 30 bucks a month with one gig of data. It goes up to $55 per month for unlimited data. Use your own SIM, no contract, no credit checks, but it's hard to find plan information and they don't sell devices. Then you have Pulse Cellular. Man, some of these I've never heard of. <laughs> All plans include unlimited talk and text. Voice only plan, $22 per month if you're looking for that. Six month contract. Going month to month will cost you five bucks extra. The plan with the most data, which is 22 gigs, costs 75 bucks with a contract. All right, so that one, a very unique old school setup. $25 SIM card fee, no newer phones in the shop. All right, so make sure you guys know those terms. Puppy wireless. That's interesting. Uh, plans start at $10 per month, 250 minutes, 250 text, 100 megs of 5G data. Limited plans start at 40 bucks, include four gigs of high-speed data. Overages are cheap, monthly and annual plans available. The cons, annual plans, annual plan includes pay-as-you-go for minutes, text, and data. BYD only, BYOD only, so you can't finance phones from them. And they've got a odd international pricing. I don't know what that means. So if interested, check it out. Red Pocket, we know. $10 per month for a gig of data and unlimited talk and text. Go for the annual rate. The same plan runs you $8 for the first year, $9 after that. Unlimited plan costs 40 bucks month to month or $25 for the first year of the annual plan. You get calling 80 countries for free. Family plans, data-only plans are available. The cons, limited plan throttles after 30 gigs and a small selection of Android phones to choose from. All right, next we have Selectel Wireless. That's a new one to us. 45 gigs of LT data for $60 per month. Limited talk and text. For half the price, you get 500 minutes, unlimited texting, and 100 megs of data. New customers get a free Nokia G100. Goodness. Uh, no contracts, no credit checks. The cons, no 5G services supported. International calling only available on their premium plans. All right, a brand that we know, uh, this would be Spectrum Mobile of Charter and Spectrum brand. All right, they've got three plans. Pay by the gig, which is $20 per month. One gig of 5G data. $5 per gig after that. It also has two unlimited plans, the 30 and the $40 plans with 30 gigs of high-speed data and 50 gigs of unthrottled data. The pros, you get mobile hotspot with all plans, no contracts, the cons, few plans to choose from. I don't really think that's a con necessarily. They got a couple of plans, right? Straight Talk, this is Verizon's track phone brands. They have the top tier plan, 65 bucks per month, gets you unlimited talk, text, and data. The cheapest plan, $30 per month, 1500 voice minutes, unlimited text, 100 megs of data. So lots of different plans, a lot of variety. Then they have the low cost, $5 per gig refill rate. The cons here, unlimited international plan is limited to 20 numbers. All right, remember they do also offer home, phone, internet, 
and discounts on more than one line. So it could be good for some people. Ting Mobile is an interesting one. This one's actually owned by Dish, but it runs on the Verizon network. Five plans. First one starting at $10 per month for the $5 per gig pay-as-you-go plan. For between $25 and $50 per month, you get 5, 12, 22, or 35 gigs of data with hotspot capability. All plans come with unlimited talk and text and 5G network access. When you pay for extra data, it carries over to the next month, so that's a good pro. The cons here can only use a fraction of your data for a hotspot and expensive international rates. All right, cool. Next, we have Twigby. All right, with Twigby, four plans available, all with unlimited talk and text. $15 per month, you get two gigs of data. And for $35 per month, you get 20 gigs of data. All plans come with $10 per month discount for the first three months, 5G coverage, unlimited talk and text, and hotspot. Free international calling to over 80 countries, unlimited texting to other countries. The cons here is there's no option to top off your data if you go over. Sounds like it's good for travelers. All right, next, uh, this one's pretty popular here within the community, US Mobile. Monthly plan starting at $29 a month, limited talk, text, and data. You do get 35 gigs of high speed. Bump up to 50 bucks a month and you get 100 gigs of unthrottled data with 50 gigs of hotspot. That plan sounds like really, really good um, option for the power user. Pros, you get international calling and roaming data on all plans. Discounts for annual plans and more than one line. The cons here has issues with Wi-Fi calling. I'm not sure if I've ever heard that, but that's something you may want to know. Um, they also sell landlines if you need one. All right, that's great. Uh, next option is Visible, a fan favorite here on the channel. They have two plans, a $25 a month plan and a $45 a month plan. You get unlimited talk, text, and data on all plans. The uniqueness about the uh, Visible Plus plan, you do get full ultra-wideband 5G support, 50 gigs of high-speed hotspot data, and uh, some, some additional perks. Pros, unlimited talk, text, and data in Canada and Mexico. The latest phones for sale or lease. Cons here, only two plans to choose from owned by Verizon, so not a true MVNO. All right, that one's actually probably the best value for the power user, right? Next, we have Walmart Family Mobile. $25 per month, limited talk, text, and 5 gig of data. $40 per month gets you 40 gigs of data and a limited calling to Canada and Mexico. Hotspot is enabled on all plans, large selection of phones to choose from. Auto pay discount only available for a single line use case. It's interesting. International calling limited to 20 unique numbers per month. All right, next we have Xfinity Mobile. This one's going to be probably more similar to like your Spectrum Mobile. Two plans, unlimited and by the gig. Limited plans start at $45 per month with 20 gig of data. It goes up to $65 a month. Gets you 50 gig of data. If you want to pay by the gig, plans start at 15 bucks for a gig. Goes to 60 bucks for 10 gigs. Top off when you need to. Discounts when you go multi-line. Large selection of phones, tablets, and watches. Cons here are the expensive data top-offs. And I think that's it. Those are all the MVNOs and prepaid options that utilize the Verizon network. There are many, some of which we never knew existed. Others are well known. And you guys could see some of the value in some of these brands. And if you don't want to pay Verizon directly and don't want to deal with them, this is how you get access to the Verizon network. Which one do you like? What do you guys think of those deals, those terms, those prices? Which do you think is the best? Are you using any of these? Let me know. Comment down below. You're the voice of the people, the SMT Nation. Let your voice be heard.